Hey everybody, this is Kuin Pack with Let's Play Bear With Me, The Lost Robots. We have Harold and Barry who won't help us. What part of get the hell out of our faces don't you understand, Snoop? Never said that. The part where you say get the hell you out. You said it just now, Gus. Don't bother. Let's go. Well, maybe we can convince them. A good crowbar is a terrible thing to waste. Oh, come on. You can be the vindicator, kid. You can, you can convince them. What's this, Bear? This? Oh, it's nothing. Just something that may... Oh, no. You're giving them the evidence, all right. ...guards to the recent series of robot kidnappings. I bet there's a matching coupon in your coat. Ooh, For that's where you get pissed. Sunside Fizz. It expires today, right? Okay, what do you two want? A, a oh, relay, please? ...told us you might know someone. Keep your bird-watching nonsense to yourself, Bear. That's not even... Okay, enough with the wisecracking. We're looking for a ratchet relay. Thank you. He said. Progressing the plot with this yeah. one. He's Join not all the into club, the, the noir a film shortage these scene. days. I mean, a luminarium might have some still. Oh yeah, go ask Skinner. I'm sure he's in a <laughs> Who's Skinner? mood given the season. No, really, who the hell is Skinner? Yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> Charitable. <laughs> right. A luminarium? Well, that doesn't sound that. safe. Yeah. You should've. Man, Betty must have messed you up something fierce. Okay, we're done here. Wow, everyone in no, town knows that Ted got shot. Was about to get <laughs> How did that happen? We'll catch you two idiots later. Ooh, foreshadowing. Ooh, of course it's gonna be that. Hey, give our regards to the missus. Uh, sure hey, thing, I funny guys. You had with the whole Betty thing. What happened there? I'm not getting into this right now. Fine. What's a luminarium? Yeah, Paper what is a luminarium? Industrial light manufacturer. Well, they ought to have. You have industrial level light manufacturer. Exactly. But their CEO is a tough nut kid. Just let me do all the talking. Sure yeah, thing, Ted. I, I believe in you. All the talking this whole time. Okay. Good. I know, because so like the Clint, Clint's been distracted or something. According to Ted, it's Clint's been distracted. I think it's more like Flint just doesn't want to. He doesn't want to play these kind of games. Oh yeah, this is um It's a piece of art, I guess. This is oh, yeah. not good looking. Geometry is now art, apparently. I bet Amber would love this. Nah, she knows art. She has a good eye and some taste, actually. Don't tell her I told you that. Hey, you tell her that in the next uh, game anyway. It's the lighting display. Are these are they functional? They don't Maybe. have any relays attached, if that's what you mean. Yeah, okay. But we can't steal the relay. It's just a bunch of papers. I doubt he would hide anything remotely suspicious in there. Are you sure about that? A paper trail. Hmm. What's this? Ooh, look at the sculpture. What the hell is that thing? That's an overpriced piece of marble, kid. It's all the rage among snobbish rich people. Wow. I mean, you like, really what is it literally? It looks like the one enemy from purchase. Earthbound. I know. Bulby! It says Bulby underneath. Let's talk to Bulby. Skinner's box. Oh, oh, hey, Let's yeah. Let's see if it talks. Howdy, y'all. It's me, Bulby. Hey, Bulby. I'm Bulby. What's your name? Flint. Are we friends? If you're ever afraid of the dark, just light me up. Wow, he seems so happy. He's the greatest guy ever. Skinner is a tyrannical overlord with complete disregard for any form of life. Everyone is Hold up. Gain. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm shiny. Hi -hi. <laughs> I'm not here against my will at all. Ooh. What's that, Bear? I have no idea. Kid. This Skinner box, though. The Look at the view. Overlooking the factory floor. Nah, it's actually pretty. So this must be practice. really high up above the factory, which would make sense for a tyrannical overlord. A oh, hard liquor. Let's God go. It. It's like I'm being tested at every step. Come on, Ted. You can have a little bit of hard liquor. Tiny bit. Oh, lamp. that's a nice lamp. Hmm. Looks expensive. What else is there to click on? Nothing, nothing, nothing. We good, we good, we good. Let's touch the paper trail to activate the cutscene. Activating the cutscene. Whoa. Oh, my God. What the? Smiley Skinner, I presume. Yeah, it's me. It's the lawman. Gentlemen, keep it short. Oh, he's got even a better voice than I could do. Leaving the country. There it is. Ted's 
famous wit. Even I'm gonna shove this cigar right where the sign don't shine. I'm afraid your infamy precedes you. You and me both, pal. Let's get right to the brass tacks. We need a ratchet relay, and it seems there's a shortage these days. You're well informed, Ted. You seem to be doing just fine in that department. How come? Now, 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 gentlemen. I wouldn't be much of a CEO if I was just to give away company secrets. Your company secrets are what we call reasonable suspicion. And what am I being suspect of? Running a successful business in the post-war depression? Is that what time period Rope this is? Kidnappings. Heard about that. Or is that just because all film noir is in that time period? Business. However, as I already told the real police, I don't know anything about that. Yeah, see, you're not real police, Bear. I don't respect you. Police. How could you tell? I'm a money man. They have mustard stains on their badges. Gentlemen, I'm afraid this is all the time I could spare. Just as an expression of goodwill, I'll tell you this. We get the relays from our reserves. Wow, that sounds, uh, shady. We buy them in bulks, so there's some left still. But hopefully this shortage won't last past this winter. I mean, that would suck, right? Sir. Gentlemen, now, if you'll excuse me. You're excused, Smiley. Could we bother you for one such relay? I'm afraid that's out of the question. Oh, I mean, he's trying to make fiscally role. responsible decisions in this crime-ridden well, city. We had to try. That's understandable. Okay, so now what? He's acting off. Right. Like he can't spare one relay? That is strange. Also, there was an interesting piece of paper on his desk. Oh, no, it's one of these dino crisis I'm puzzles, sure. isn't it? Let's go back to the Union. I need to speak to that copper crone again. Oh, well, we're going to go talk to Wierkowski, apparently. Hey, Wierkowski, where are you? Yeah, there we go. Hey, Wierkowski, we got plans. We might be able to fix your Robbie. Just get some answers. Just I wanted to see. Any news? They Maybe. say that hyperinflation Maybe. is inevitable. Apparently, it's common in post-war economy. About the case? Any news about the case? That is part of the case. Right. We found Robbie. Robertson? Oh, Robertson is his last name. I was just calling him Robbie Robot. Yeah. No, I mean no. He's pretty dismantled right now. But how? It's fine. We can fix him. We're missing a single component, though. Yeah, we got all the parts but what one, lady. Kid. It's kind of the problem. Ratchet relay. Oh, but there's a shortage these days. You think? Anyways, <laughs> Everybody's been we saying found that. someone who might have some still. But he wasn't really cooperative. Skinner? Oh, so you know Smiley. That heartless scumbag. He wouldn't spare a light bulb to save his own son. And he's a, he owns a light bulb right, factory. If we get the thing, the hatchet. Ratchet relay. relay. Thank you. Thanks, kid. We can get valuable information. We could close the case. Well, what are you waiting for? Go get it! Um, that might require some breaking in. I seriously don't care. Just get the relay. Just Ted. do it, you stupid okay. whore. Okay. You, you got right, two close. feet and I only got one get leg, which is a wheel. Solve the case. Bye, Miss Lift. Get out. Sheesh. See what I mean? Let's go, kid. There's a bar downtown we have to visit first. Oh, we're gonna go to the bar? Hell yeah! Let's get drunk, kid. Kid, we're gonna get a need to get smashed before the elite mission kicks in. Something suspicious about that uh lifty lady. What's Something real boys? suspicious. The usual Jay. I'll have the same. No, he won't. Give him a lemonade. Hey, coming right up. Oh come on, give Flinty Tough alcohol. Night. Ah, kid. Okay, I gotta ask now. What's the deal with um Betty? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> you better know Fine. it. All right. Hey, we're There's finally going to get the backstory. Actress, Betty, she and I, we were an item. So what happened? Something idiots like me tend to do, kid. I messed up. Can't you, like, apologize? <laughs> <sighs> Not this time. You'll get it when you're a bit older. You care for her. I did. But that's all over with. I did. Oh, Is see? It? You're having a hard time with this case. Ed was having a very hardcore affair with two women yeah. and a man who was well, a woman. So do you. And since we're sharing, you know, mind telling you know what the, the deal hell is going on now. I mean, also, Ted was probably in a dress There's too, knowing Ted. He, he gets he gets real drunk and then does crazy while. things in yeah. his own little regard Kid, world. Where is your sister? She's fine. It was very debaucherous because see, nobody knew who where they were. Like that. nobody knew who she was what in that whole pile. It was just a pile of stuffing and genitals. What? Why? What's wrong? 
She secretly ate one of the cookies from my porch. <gasps> my mom and dad had to take her to the hospital. What the hell? You could have told me that. Uh, I'm so sorry. Son of a I mean, bitch. Amber's fine. allergic. Is she? It's not fine, Ted. She's she's really sick, and it's all my fault. She Kid. ate one... She had an allergic reaction. She ate one cookie, it's and it killed her, man. But it is okay. We got into a fight before bedtime about the cookies, and I dared her to eat one. And that was your idiot mistake. Hey, now, come on. Kids, you know, they do stupid things like this all the time. I know, he's not in Red his 40s Jane. like you. Also, some adults I know. No. <laughs> okay, you're making this worse. The point is, everyone makes their own choices. And sure, it is kind of sad how there might destroyed be point is else, over this. But in the end, it all comes down to what you'll decide. No one can do that for you. It yeah, so it's up to your choices for life. She couldn't breathe, and then I just stood there. I didn't know what to do. Don't worry, kid. Amber's tough. She'll be Weird fine. that she has an allergy to she banana. She went through this once before, remember? She did? Whoa, now. that's confusing. You're waiting for them to come back. That's why you're here. I... I didn't know what to do, so... I thought I'd help her out with the case while I wait, you know? I thought... It was something to do, right? I can't stand the waiting. I get it. But don't be so hard on yourself. Here's the problem. The fact that you're bothered so much by it really shows that you but genuinely care about your sister. Right, Jay? So you messed up. It happens. The house. Just ask this um, guy over there. I mean... But you seem like a good kid to me. None of us are perfect, laddie. We all make mistakes. I mean, it, well, it was an honest mistake. Words, older siblings tend to egg on their younger ones when their younger ones have little shits. Where a man As the oldest of three, I can tell you, it's a nut job job. Talking with the younger two is a nightmare. Middle child is absolutely bad That's shit right. crazy. Like right now, you have a choice. You can stay here and And the youngest is, as enough. always, you know, or a little shit. You can make the it's what happens. And come help me. But they're family. The you have to respect that point. That doesn't seem like the right choice at all. I guess it doesn't. But hey, it's something to do, right? Thanks, Bear. Thanks for what? For giving me something no, to I'm, do. No, I'm serious. It's, just, it's something to do. No, I just it's, I just got out of the hospital like after a roof fall and an ear shot. Ahead. You and I. Uh, should I put this on No time tablet? to talk, Jay. The kid <laughs> and I have a case to solve. Just go. Go, kid, go. Run, kid, run. We're not paying. Run. Run. No, no, no pay. Later that night. So, Amber's in the hospital currently because she is uh, allergic to what was in his cookies. His cookies were banana nut cookies. They right, were banana. She's we not allergic to the are. nuts, though. She's so, allergic to the once banana. We get you over that fact, That's something you learn the in the other playthrough. What? Are you insane? These are the latest Cyberus V8 Robo Dogs. I'm not going anywhere near them. Don't forget the searchlight. Sure, and the searchlight. It'll be like a candlelight dinner to them. Okay. Hey, it's Bye. finally time to uh, hey, use some of our items. Best idea. I mean, it's just negligence at this point, Ted. All right, fine. Don't worry. We'll figure something out. Hey, what about that car over there? Yeah, what, what about, about that car over I'm there? Going to ram it into that fence. I mean, sure. That's a. I mean, Ted as always as with the destructive ideas. So. There's a guardhouse. Could be over there. there. Worth a look. I'm seeing uh, electricity bolts Let's up go. there that are moving at oddly specific frames per second. Pretty we good. Need to find a way in. Why don't you? One that doesn't include me getting eaten, Ted. <laughs> right, right. Ted, just sack the kid. Dear God. You only like Amber, anyways. Terrifying. The poster child for slave labor. I mean, why would they have this in front of their own <laughs> Lighting your way to a better future. A luminarium. Oh, it's cool. empty. What do they eat anyways? Unlucky trespassers, I guess. Yeah, that's what robo-dogs do. State of Oops. State-of-the-art chewing machines? I'm not getting close. Exactly. It says keep out. That's what it says. That is what it says. How about it's a car? It's a car of some sort. What a heap of junk. Even you don't know what it is. It's worthless. I don't have the keys. Oh, mother fucker. How about the searchlight? Can I look at the searchlight? Is there any way to look at the searchlight? There isn't any way to look at the searchlight. Well, let's go to the guardhouse then. Real Wait. Wait. I want to do this before I end the video. This is where the nuts and bolts come in. 
So, robots, right? All right, this should keep them busy for a while. This is the power of robot time. Zoink, Scoob! Ooh, we're gonna need that rubber ball. Give me that rubber bouncy ball, baby. Quimpact right. now has the ball. Now. Maybe don't rub it in their faces. Yeah, I mean, they look like they could easily leap the fence to kill you, kid. Let's be real, they're robots. And this has been Quimpact with Let's Play. Bear with me, the lost robots. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment next time. Maybe we can solve this case and wrong the mistakes we've done against our little sibling.